In this demonstration, we're going to be drawing a penguin using our bingo dabber. This is what our penguin will look like when we're all finished. First, you wanna make sure you have your artist signature on the bottom left corner and your class code on the back. I'm gonna start off with the top line, drawing two small circles and then color them in, leaving a tiny bit of white for the highlight of the eye. If you accidentally fill them in completely, that is okay. Then we're going to draw the beak, which is a triangle. You're gonna start with a short horizontal line and two diagonal lines to make a V. Next, we're going to do the penguin's face. You're going to use an M shape. You're gonna start at the bottom of the beak and up and back down. Then we're going to add the hat. You're going to draw a horizontal line touching the top of the penguin's head with two short vertical lines going up. Then we're going to close that to make a rectangle for the top of the hat. You're going to find the top of your paper and draw a little circle right at the top. That's the ball on the top of the hat with two diagonal lines to finish the hat. Next, we're gonna draw the scarf. We're gonna do the same horizontal line with two short vertical lines and close to make a rectangle. We're going to do a curved line from the hat to the scarf on both sides to finish the penguin's head. I'm gonna color in the back. The penguin's head is black here, a little bit here on both sides. Remember not to squeeze your dabber while you're working. On the side, we're going to draw a little rectangle for the scarf and another one next to it for the other part of the scarf. Now we're going to draw the penguin's body. The body's gonna go down to this line, leaving room for his feet. I'm gonna start here and do a big curve down to the line and back up to the scarf. Then we need to draw the inside U for the penguin's belly that is white. So we're gonna draw another U inside and color in around the small U. Next, we need some arms for our penguin. We're gonna draw a little arm on each side and color them in black. And the last thing for our penguin is to draw some feet. The feet look like W's, so you're gonna start on one side and make a big W, and then same thing on the other side. Using zigzag lines. And the last thing you could do is if you want to add some patterns to your hat and scarf. And you have a penguin.